Hello everyone and welcome in. My name is Lorna, this is Colin. Hello. And together we are We Bit Reacts and this is our very first episode in our series of My Boyfriend Reacts, uh, which is basically where I share my beloved films or films that I've enjoyed, that I've seen and Colin hasn't seen them. Um, so we're starting out with The Conjuring. Um, I haven't actually watched it since release, but it's definitely up there as one of the most enjoyable um, like spoopy movies that I have seen and I'm really excited because uh, Colin doesn't really watch horrors that much so he's not going to get jump scared either so I'm just interested to see I think I don't know it's just like for me like because I, do I, I don't really get jump scared at horrors I get more horrified like if there's like a lot of like gore or like bad like I start panicking for people but I don't really get like I'm not scared of horrors but you definitely don't don't I get scared don't like the stories of horror, but anyway honest. this one has got a really good story so i actually think you're gonna like it colin's gonna hate it and you're all gonna come for him again in the comments that's my favorite thing like everyone's just like colin hates everything <laughs> that's his reputation i love <laughs> everything colin hates everything <laughs> and we balance each other out that's why we're together yang, yang. exactly Anyways, alongside the series, we do have a My Girlfriend Watches series, which is where Colin's watched some things and I haven't watched them, so he's sharing his favourite bits and bobs with me as well. And then we are hoping to add a new series uh, once we come back from our holiday in Japan, uh, maybe towards the end of the year, I as a, like, a kind of throwback um, type of series where we watch things that maybe we've already watched before, we've watched it a bazillion times, but we still want to share it with you. So we're going to do like the occasional wee... Like, throwback nostalgia hit um and i think that's it if you've got to this point you haven't subscribed please consider doing so if you want to join us over on patreon we are still running the offer um because it's a soft launch we only have one tier at the minute of recording and basically anyone who signs up um in this month so august 2023 you will have your name um added at the end of every movie in september and it's only two pound or three dollars so it's pretty pretty cheap at the minute we're hoping to fully launch mm -hmm. in a little while we're yeah. just building ourselves up we've got a backlog of extra content so that when we do launch we've got a ton of stuff to kind of get stuck into so we're really looking forward to that and um, i don't think i've got anything else to add really i'm really excited because because you don't like horrors i'm just like i feel like i want to try to impress you with really good horrors and there's some really good ones out there this is not my favorite horror movie though of all time let me know in the hereditary. comments below no no that no? hereditary is a very good horror but that's not my favorite of all time oh. um let me know in the comments below what your favorite like horror spooky um gory type of movie is uh, my favorite one is actually called the descent and it's very good and i've seen it about twenty five thousand times Anyways, let's get into it. I oh. do have a question. Oh, yes. So, The Conjuring yep. and Insidious, are they connected? <laughs> Don't laugh, because I googled The Conjuring. Because I was like, are they connected? Because they've got the same guy. And we re previously recorded an intro. But then I got so sidetracked. I had to Google during the intro. So we like started again. <laughs> Anyways, they did come out around about the same time. They've got the same guy in it. But they are not connected, if anybody was wondering. So yeah, thank you so much for exposing me like that. That's Colin's way of being like, you've made me do this intro three times now. <laughs> this is actually the third time for sure. <laughs> Anyways, uh, let's just get into the conjuring. Oh, I, because obviously everyone likes, well, you know, our year intros are so long. Well, I might as well just add a little extra bit so that it is long. But I just want to say we love you so, so much. So anyway, this is the conjuring. <laughs> also, I think this is uh, based on a true story. Don't look at me like that. Don't look at me like that a second time it is. Maybe based on people's true accounts. She wanted to live with us by inhabiting the doll. The doll is so freaky and creepy. Oh my, I would, I would be dead. I would die. <laughs> freaky. Now they've had enough. Yep. And they've been with you. Again, I would be dead. Even though it's a spooky moment, fun Scottish fact, we say chap instead of knock. Whoosh! I actually got a jump scare. I never really get a jump scare. You've seen this. So I think she's really creepy. Uh, yep. 
for something extremely manipulative? I'm not hot as well, actually. Mm -hmm. It's something that's never walked the earth in human form. It's something demonic. Something evil. Yes, man. Love demons. I honestly just remember this being amazing, but I can't remember all the details, so I'm a pure buzzing. <laughs> Okay, since the 1960s, Ed and Lorraine Warren have been known as the world's most renowned paranormal investigators. Lorraine is a gifted clairvoyant, while Ed is the only non-ordained demonologist recognised by the Catholic Church. Out of the thousands of cases throughout their controversial careers, there is one case so malevolent they've kept it locked away until now. Told you it was based on a true story. I forgot so much about it, I'm actually really buzzing. It's not a true story, it's a Two events that they believed happened. I'm not going to believe that there was a doll kicking about. Well, like, well. Oh God, we in the middle of I love how so many horrors start with people moving into a new house in the country. <laughs> they start a better life. Do I get to pick my own room, or do I have no choice in that either? And there's always one that doesn't like it, and they're the teenager. <laughs> Can't wait. Hi, baby. See you. Let's go. He knows. She's a good boy. Is it a she, so? Yep. I love her. She knows or something up. Yeah. Who's your daddy? Who's your daddy? I love this song, actually. That goes in the living room. Hey, Andrea, where's my windshine? Is this the country in a home alone? Quite some of the scene of like, when they go into the house and they're all trying to pack up and... I love that. That's cute. A spooky music box, eh? Yeah. I'm like a lot of these kind of shots where it's like out fun zooms in. Mm -hmm. It's quite a, a horror trope. Nine for ten. Ready or not, here I come. I love this version of hide and seek, but we we don't play it like this, and I want to one day. Yeah, no, you need to go you push. Oh, a secret room, maybe. I think we have a cellar or something. I love how as if I've never seen it before. I'm pure excited. I can't remember all the little bits though. Anyway. Also, would like to let everyone know, wouldn't go down there. No, absolutely not. <laughs> I wonder why it was boarded up. I know why it was boarded up. Because it's spooky. Sadie! <laughs> hey, be quiet. Well, if I thought, like, hey, be quiet, I'd be like, hi, BB, I'm sleeping outside with you, and I'm going <laughs> to hug you, and I'm going to pet you, and I'm going to love you. And if my dog wasn't coming in my house, I'm moving. Not for the spookies. Not for I'm the spookies. moving because I love the dog. Yeah. Dog's like, nah. And I'm like, oh well, dog's spoken. <laughs> I've actually forgot so many little things about this. I'm going to really enjoy it. I am really enjoying it. See the weird girl that was blindfolded? Mm-hmm. I think that's half from Evil Dead. And there was this really funky smell in my bedroom last night. It reeked like something died. Is it still there? No. Problem solved. <laughs> <laughs> Touché. Mm -hmm. Down here, honey. Again, wouldn't go down. No. Actually, I'd probably go down in the morning, I. Nope. I would leave it abandoned forever. I'm already scared for everyone. <laughs> I just get really panicky. I always want everyone to be okay. Hmm. Hmm. All the clocks have stopped at the same time. Sadie! Shut up. Nothing's happened to the dog, right? Shut up, I don't even remember this. I've probably blanked it because it's traumatic for me. I don't even remember that. The, the dog is away to see the reverse of his name. Destroy it. Well, that would only destroy the vessel. Sometimes it's better to keep the genie in the bottle. Oh, I like that analogy. Oh, I totally forgot. I, I've genuinely blanked that out. How did they, how did they not know that was going to happen? Those who say they. S-E-D-I-E. -E. And, and she done a sad die. Stop farting. It really stinks. Don't blame that on me. It's you. Well, it was one of these. Mm-hmm. Disgusting. Couldn't resist. <gasps> yep, no. Again, <laughs> I would be noped out. Same. It's when they go investigate, and I'm like, yeah, no, that's never... I'm... No. Hey, right, kids, we're going. I'm setting this place on fire. That's not for me, that. Not at all. Oh, nothing happened, but I went, oh. <laughs> no wonder it's cold if they're leaving all the windows opened. Oh, 
Oh, shh, stop that. When I was trying to pretend I didn't get jump scares to sound like as if I was pure tough. <sighs> Sorry, all. I remember you saying not to wake her if she's like this. So. No, we just put her back to bed. Have you ever slept, walk, sleepwalked, walked a in your sleep? A few times I've been told, I like three o'clock, I've walked into my mum's room, like all ready. Well, not ready, but like saying, wait, ready to go to school. Honey, you got another bruise here. Hmm? Does that hurt? Is the doctor going to blame him? I don't know. I oh, know. Oh. I would have loved that bird if I. Yeah, also no, but I wouldn't, I wouldn't look into this. Nah, I would, because I wouldn't, I wouldn't suspect it was a bit to happen. Boo, mommy! <laughs> oh, got him. Thank God it wasn't me, because I've got the reactions. I don't... <laughs> Hello? 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 Yeah, again, I don't know. Yeah, that freaked me out. Yep. Nope. How about you know what I'm now? Florida. It's a week turnaround. I start tomorrow. I would be like, sorry, you have to give up your job because I'm scared. <laughs> uh, you'll need to just quit it. <laughs> She's made a mistake because her feet aren't under the cover, so any of it's just it's anybody's oh, feet at that point. Fair game. Yeah, yeah, fair, fair game. Got to keep your feet under the covers at all times. Even a wee peek. Yeah, realised I was doing it and sat back. It's standing right behind you. Oh, don't do that. Oh, I'm really scared. It wants my family dead. Forgot how good this was, actually. Yeah, that was freaky. Mm -hmm. oh, kids are so spooky. I love her house coat, by the way. It's a bell, isn't it? Mm hmm are they all in bed? Whoa! Shh, absolutely not. Hey. Shut up. They need no more nails. Also, how did nobody else wake up? Also, why is she going down the stairs? Get back upstairs. Don't. You're going to cut yourself. Don't. Nope. Don't go near that. Nope. Nope. Go back. Don't go down there. That's all I'm saying. Don't go down there. No need to. Just stay up top. Shut the door. Didn't do that. Who's ever down there? I'm gonna lock you in now. Oh, ah. Uh. I can't breathe. I stopped breathing. I forgot to pay. And they were pre -bru bruises. Well, that was a saurian, by the way. Definitely. I wouldn't have as chill as that if I fell down the stairs like that. Hey, wanna play hide and clap? Nope. <laughs> That's horrifying, man. One time the mum's just copped it. I'm scared again. What's making the noise? Again, nope, not go. I wouldn't go for there. Wouldn't go for there. I'll go right back in my bed under the covers. I wouldn't go. Don't go. Just go back. Go back. I wouldn't go. I've seen this and I'm still. I'm terrified. <laughs> Such a loser. <laughs> oh! Stop. What happened? <laughs> They'll tell you when they calm down. No need to be yeah. angry. They need help. If they're freaking out, they're freaking out for a reason. Yeah. Or imminence of danger. Massachusetts. That's it right there. Mm -hmm. Hey, Ed, Lorraine. Yeah. There's someone here that would like to talk to you. Oh, he's in the 100. Is it? He? He's the son. Oh, from the so spaceship. Is, yeah. Please, can you come and take a look? Yeah, go help. They need it. I'm scared. Love how I've seen it. But I, I remember like the overall story, but I don't remember what you don't remember where like the specific things are. Yeah, well, it's been 10 years. New series, my boyfriend Riochi's girlfriend reacts. <laughs> <laughs> nice to meet you, Roger Ed Warren. Thank you. Oh, she senses something right away. We're all sleeping down here now. Mm. The girls feel safer and it's warmer. I love how they're still there. I'd be, I'd be awake. Show me the cellar. Why does everyone want to go in the cellar? Oh, Don't go man. in the cellar. Just fill it with concrete. You're picking up anything in here, hon? Yeah, she did. I haven't just moved out. Exactly. I'd slip in the car. I 
Again, not with the music box. It's got a creepy clown in it. Brilliant. Hypnotized. Should I see him? <gasps> Maybe he's there. That was Annabelle. No, that was Rory. It was a wee boy and. Oh, was the Annabelle clothes. with a haircut? No, it was a wee Annabelle's boy. Annabelle's brother. Do you know what? They've not told them about the dog. That was the first occurrence. That was the, the first clocks. occurrence, you're right. Some they forgot about that dog already, and I love that dog. <laughs> Dog should have been I should really said eh, that they forgot that. Oh. Cause he's sad, eh? I he's forgot not. how good this was. I knew it was good, but it's really good. <sighs> oh no, she knows there's all sorts of ads. I think that might have been the thing that was on top of the wardrobe. Mm. This dark entity has latched itself to your family. And it's feeding off you. Shut up. No. I'm so worried for everyone. Hmm? I'm so worried. Hmm. Church has to authorize it first. It means we gotta investigate, gather evidence, and provide proof. I mean, there's a lot going on there. I don't think it's gonna be that hard to get the proof. <laughs> we'll take the spirits to court or something like that. So far, it hasn't done anything violent, and that's a good sign. I mean, it hit her with the door in the face. That's pretty violent. No, not to them. When the baby was seven days old, Judson caught her sacrificing it in front of the fireplace. No! Stop! Cursed anyone who tried to take her land and hung herself. Time of death, Rio, seven in the morning. It's all, it's all stacking up now. That's the times when the clock stop. Yep. Why are you staying up at that time? You should be in your bed. Has it latched onto them then? Yeah, maybe. As if I've seen it and I'm like, I, I know it was good. I'm just like, I don't, I remember, but I don't remember. I think we'll just change the title of this to first time reaction. It's actually so good. I, I just remember it being such a spot on horror. You know you can't shoot ghosts, right? Okay, so let me get this stuff unloaded. They're going to get set up. I'd shoot the ghost with some of my put downs. Get out my house, you spooky person. Who needs an exorcism when you've got uh, those kind of moves? Time to gather the evidence. I'm liking a lot of these editing choices. Mm-hmm. No, it's shot very well. Love me a wee UV light. That's what the naked eye can't see. Pretty far out, isn't it? Yeah, it's groovy. It's groovy and far out. Starting already. Oh. <laughs> I'm nervous again. Yeah, I wonder if it's going to be like a smart ghost and just know the end for a good while. Hmm. Brad, get the camera. Oh, don't go down. I've said it before. Just nope. Nope, she felt some. See that? Mm hmm. Or she touched something yucky on the wood beam. Uh, maybe. Sounds pretty good there. Yeah, the sound production is really good here. Uh -oh. oh no. Close the door, move something. I'm nervous. Piano? Hmm? There was a wee noise. I believe the clock. It's 308. Mm, I think you're right. It's like smart. It's like it knows. Like, I'm not going to incriminate myself. I'm no sully. Mm -hmm. I would love pancakes right now. And melon. I think her husband's gonna get worried about her. Because mm -hmm. of what happened the last time with the exorcism. I agree. <laughs> I love them. Mm -hmm. I love love. Seem like good I people. Love, love. love in the love. Bombs are coming. Oh, it's coming in fast. Did you oh. see that? That was good. Oh my goodness, oh, stop. No. no, I'm scared. I'm worried. Are you okay? I'm fine. You sick? I woke up just feeling a little nauseous, that's all. Uh, no, you don't. He's been possessed. Mm-hmm. Oh, that was scary. Well, Lorraine and I always wanted a spot in the country. 
I'll sell you this one. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that hustle, love it. Whatever Lorraine sees, feels, touches, it helps people, but it also takes a toll on her. He loves her. Mm-hmm. I'm good, thanks. No. Are these sizzles going? <laughs> They're massive. I was just like staring at them going, what the heck? No, go back inside. <laughs> oh, Colin, don't do that. Colin, don't do that. I didn't like it. Look what she made me do. That was really mean. Yeah, oh, so did you see that ghost lady? Yeah, okay. I'll try to hold my hand as well. Look what she made me do. Oh, sugar. You just said, no, 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 no. Wait, wait, wait. We need this. Why don't we need pictures of Cindy? It's not Cindy. I mean, she didn't trigger somebody's with her. She's going back to that wardrobe. Cindy! Oh, I'm scared. Cindy? She's in the wardrobe, right? Ed, where'd she go? Hens. Mm -hmm. And the room's freezing as well. Yeah. Oh, I'm scared. Where does this go? Found her. Oh, my dear Lord. That's where Rory hides when he's afraid. You know too much. I think Rory's a, a good spirit though. Rory went missing. Maybe his body's in there. Oh, his body never found. I don't know, I said he went missing, eh? <sighs> oh, I'm worried again. Sugar. Oh, this is horrifying. That would have been some drop, but wasn't as wasn't as far as that. It's not like eight stories. Two or something, right? Mm-hmm. She's oh. in the basement. Well, maybe three, including the basement. No, don't do it. Oh, clever, clever, clever. Okay. Why clever? Why does she want him? I don't think it's for him. Ah. Oh. oh no! She made me do it. She's so calm. Oh! Whoa. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. Oh, I knew I was gonna get a fright. I knew it was coming. That's that witchy lady, I think. Yeah. As if she's turning. Oh no! <gasps> what the hell is she doing? Oh my God. No! She possessed the mother to kill the child. If that's what the bruise marks are, she's feeding off of her. Oh, now they know what's happening. Uh, Nancy. Oh, that's scary. <laughs> oh. Jesus. I wonder if those scissors are like special because it's like iron or something or silver or. Oh, right, okay. Oh, is it the locket? Yeah, the locket, but I just feel like something bad's going to happen to Lorraine. I had a vision of Judy in the water. I know it was some kind of warning. I know it would be scary though. Let's get out of here. Oh, I wonder if they'll be tempted just to leave it. No, they need to help. No, no. Oh, the poor mum. Ah, oh, that's brilliant. I like that. Yeah, it was nice, wasn't it? And the family, they're not members of the church. Yeah, but they need help, Padre. Oh, look at all the orb. Oh my goodness, terrifying. I'll push it through myself. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So was Rory guiding her to the hidey hole to, hit, to save her? Uh, that's what I'm saying. He, I think he might be a good spirit. I'm not sure. I honestly can't remember. Uh. Wait, are they back in the house? Did they not go to a motel? Oh no, that's her locket. The girls one, because they're yeah. locked. <gasps> no. <sighs> Stop. Again? Nope, I'd be under the covers. Oh, go back to bed. Wake up your granny. Shut up, that door's open. No, you've been tilt. She's been tilt. She's not going in. You're all right. 
Shh, no, where's the doll? No, I'm scared. Oh, no, I don't like it. Oh, I hate it, I hate it. DK. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, they're nearly home. They know. Oh, no, I don't know what's happening. I don't like it. Oh, my goodness. Good save, Dad. Oh my god, this is escalating. Oh. She's still in the case. It's okay. It's okay. They better believe her. If they've seen all that and then they don't believe her because she's still locked in the case, I will, I'll fight people. Yeah. Mom just left with Christine in April. Oh no. Oh, this is uh, bad. Everything's bad. She possesses the mother to kill the child. That's what she does. Yep. She's taking them back to the house. Oh my goodness, this is scary. You think I'm going to let you walk into this alone? I can't lose you. You won't. You might. You are a team. They're a team. Like us. Cabbage. Darn it. Just get the police to arrest them. That's one way to open the door. Oh my goodness, I'm really scared. Don't! Oh, sugar. Oh, shh. Oh, my goodness. Don't touch her. Oh, she can't uh, leave. Oh, no. So, oh, my goodness. Roger! Oh, that's. I don't know what to say. My breath is away. Oh. Where's the other Wayne? Where's the other Wayne? I know where she is. With Rory. April! Oh, you know, it's the time as well. As well. Oh, sh oh, she's strong. <gasps> oh, no. Brad's missing a bit of his face now. Oh, do you think they'll be able to save her? I hope so. Oh, my goodness. He's too far away. She won't make it. Look at her. Are you going to try and do it? He's got to. I have to do it. The exorcism. You can do it. Yes, he can. I'm not leaving you. Damn it, Lorraine. I'm not doing this with you in here. You are a team. Lorraine's going to cop it. Don't say stuff like that. Be positive. Lorraine's gonna be okay. Thank you. April! Come on, think. You know where she is. She's in the wardrobe. All these editing shots, I'm actually loving every single one of them. They're very good. It's very well shot. The story's good as well for a whole yeah, yeah, no, really it's, it's really good. Like I picked a good one. Fende no sempralio. Oh, sugar. You got this. Keep going. Oh no, it's the birds. I think it's about to get a little hitchcock up in here. <laughs> Kamikaze crows, man. I feel like something bad's gonna happen. Well, I mean, a lot of bad things are happening. It's just, I don't something know. Something gonna happen. I'm sweating from nerves. Yeah, something worse is going to happen, you think? Oh, I'm scared. Oh, damn. Oh, she's freaky. She's freaky. Oh, sugar. No, keep going, mate. Don't stop, buddy. Why did he stop? Mate, this isn't your first rodeo. Get talking. I'm too scared for everybody. Uh-oh. Oh, shh. Damn it! Let her go! Uh-oh. She's already gone. No, she's not. No. Holy. I found her! She's under the house! Under the kitchen! Oh, no, no, no. She's going to go get her. All right, because Rory's going to be like... Up, 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 up. Oh, I'm really scared. Oh, yeah. uh, no! Bathsheba! I condemn you back to hell! Oh my goodness, I'm so worried. Come on back, Carol. Come on, kick that demon's butt. Oh no, I feel sad now. It's working, I think. <laughs> yes, get out, you spooky bitch. That's it, vomit up that spirit. Oh my goodness, she looks freaky. That's rough. Oh. She can get outside now. Yeah, look, like the bruises are clearing up. Mm hmm I love you so much. Oh, look what she's got in her hand. What? The 
the locket for Lorraine. Ah. They two are proper heroes, man. <sighs> yes, they are. They drafted that to your face? <laughs> Jesus. I'd take a guy with a gun any day. <laughs> Love the sass. You did good. No, you did. Oh, I'm so happy. I was sweating so bad through uh, all that. Ah, I like the wee callback here. She ran up with the pancakes earlier, mm -hmm. Yeah, she did have the locket. Well spotted. That's subtle wee details, but that a lot of movies don't do. Mm -hmm. Like she had it the whole time. It didn't just come out of nowhere. What are they going to put in here? I think the music box is wrong. I think the music box is for Rory, but I think Rory's good. The Vatican improved the exorcism. <laughs> <laughs> well, in Pope. Annabelle's not in a box. Oh, he didn't even check. Diabolical forces are formidable. These forces are eternal and they exist today. The fairy tale is true. The devil exists. God exists. And for us, us as people, our very destiny hinges upon blah, 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 blah. Oh. <laughs> no, that was down. Oh, spooky. Ooh. The Perrin family. So this is, I guess, who, it, well, that's who it's based on. Yeah. And there's the Warren family. I believe Ooh. they believe that happened. That's a true story, mate. Okay, so that was my first pick for my boyfriend's first time watching Boyfriend Reacts. Don't know what the title's going to be. <laughs> what did you think? I really enjoyed that. It was so good. I'm really surprised at how much I enjoyed that. Nice. I wasn't sure if you were going to like it. I, I felt really a bit hate accurate. horrors and how bad the stories are. Yeah. But that, that is slightly different. That mm -hmm. doesn't deal with the, hor the horror tropes. But like, I'm expecting the dad and everybody to be like, to go, oh, everything's fine. Do you know what I mean? It's not happening. It's like pure denial for most of the film. But it's not. As soon as there's creepy stuff, they go, nah, no, we're going to see something. I know he said he was skeptic, but he wasn't really going, no, I'm not doing this. Yeah, like he was still being like, do you know what? Something is defo happening to my family and we're doing something about yep. it. I um, I seen it when it came out and I think I only had seen it the once. I don't think I've seen it since. So um, I knew like the story, I guess. But you know how that, like, I just felt like I was watching it again. Because you don't remember like every, like every little little detail i honestly how good is it is uh, it's a it's really, really good, good horror it's, it's more it was more like a oh, i can't even say the other word right but so everybody can laugh at it when i say this right mm. it's more like a, a horror thriller yeah then uh, no i know. think i think it's like um no i would say it's like tradition like it's like good spirit possession demons about air exorcism thrown in some birds i would say actually what it does is and, and you said like with horror shows, i think it obviously like i am a huge horror fan i love how i was trying to be like guys i don't get scared i'm like i love being scared though so that's fine but i think what it does is that it takes like um what horror is built on because I, one of the things about like horror or gore movies or that whole kind of genre is a lot of the times you get something and um it's kind of a bit cheesy anyway. Like, so it's kind of like written into the genre is that sometimes, quite often, it can be cheesy. But I think what Conjuring does really well is that it still draws on all those things that we've come to know and love, but it isn't cheesy and they like layer it on. So it feels a bit more fleshed out. Yeah. The shots were really good. The, the music was so good. Well. I just love some of the transitions and some of the camera movements. I'm so glad you loved like, that. I was really worried. It was, it was really good. But I also just like the dynamic of like the mm -hmm. Warren family. Yeah. Like, usually, like, again, with horrors, it's, like, centralised and it just deals with the people that are in it. Mm -hmm. But, like, the fact that they bring in people to help and they set up the cameras yeah. and, like, there's other people there. Mm -hmm. Like, I don't really... Maybe I've not seen enough horrors in. Maybe yeah. I've literally only seen the bad ones. Yeah. Or not the bad ones, but the stereotypical ones. Sometimes, though, I think, especially for this genre, sometimes bad is really good as well. I think you just need to know what you're getting into. Yeah. Um, and like it's like it's really about that oh sometimes or that oh or uh, like in this one this is more like in your head you've got like a spirit there's not as much gore it's not as like not as much body horror or whatever yeah and uh, so i'm just like really worried for everyone but like when it comes to like gore but i'm like oh i can't do it i'm like <laughs> oh no stop it but i'm really no, glad i did really i really enjoyed that and as i said like 
it's funny. I'm come. I'm I'm more open to them now because when we went to see, is it Evil Dead Rises? The most Evil recent Dead one? Rise, yeah. Uh, Evil Dead Rise. I remember leaving that and going, "Oh, that was awful." And then when I really think back, it was the. I think. Did I say it was awful? No, I didn't enjoy no, it. Did, or did I no, say it was you okay? didn't say it was awful at all. No. You said it was just okay. Uh, but which then is when fine. I really think back, I go, it was actually pretty decent. Yeah, I think that, well, if, if people who aren't into horror, I mean, obviously some people are just too scared. It's not for them. That's fine. But I think a lot of the time, for people who aren't keen on it, I think they just go in and they're expecting like, blockbuster movie with like loads of character dynamics mm-hmm. it's going to be really deep it's going to be not but that is not like horror's just there to make you think and to get me tingle at the back of your neck and feel worried and mm-hmm. you know like whatever and it doesn't have to be great and again like sometimes cheesy is really good but i think i said at the beginning of the thing my my favorite well i've got like a lot but it's always hard to choose my favorite but i think my favorite is the scent and you haven't seen it i've seen it a lot so it won't be I won't. I won't, I don't think I would react the same. Um, but then sometimes as well, like because we're doing the reactions, I'm trying to like I guess like think out loud anyway. So even if I have seen it, I'm still trying to like en- like engage with it, yeah. like not from a first time point of view, but just like like it is natural if yeah, you know what I mean. You. Just like get my thoughts out. But yeah, I think my favorite is actually this one. Nice. And there I'm pretty go. sure that the uh, the girl Christine in this was the 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 oldest daughter in evil dead rise she might have been i can't actually remember but yeah i feel really like we've, we've hit it on the success head nail on the head success we've done it i've done it round of applause for did me you like scale? i didn't like it no <laughs> absolutely pooped my pants uh thank you for that <laughs> for those who don't know by the way i make gaming content for my full-time job I'm on a uh, like I stream on Twitch full time and I create content on TikTok as well. And Colin has a thing where he actually normally crawls under my desk when I'm playing spooky games and he grabs my foot and it's horrifying. I did not think that you would do it when we're trying to be professional reactors. Don't you read the comments where it's like, use talk too much, use her too chatty, use her too. I didn't talk, I went boo. <laughs> You aren't professional enough. It, just so you know, if you leave comments like that, that's okay. We don't, it doesn't, it's fine. We're not here. You can't always please everyone. What I just hope, so you see, actually, can I tell you, see when we get comments where people are like, your intro's too long, or I don't know, you're not funny, or do, can I tell I genuinely feel really worried for people because I just think, I hope they're okay because I honestly have watched a lot of rubbish content in my life. I make content for a living. My, my gaming content is probably rubbish, right? I've never felt like, hold on till I just, I'm not good time. So I always feel really bad for everyone when they leave comments like that. So I always try to treat like the negative comments like with a lot of kindness. Colin's like, nah, I'm going to say this. And I'm like, you can just be nice. Like, so... I'm out here like combating these trolls like I'm so sorry that but I really hope you have a good day or your intros are too long I'm like you know you can skip it like I just want people to know that like life is too short protect your peace and if our content is like irritating you and it's not for you skip it mute it move on like don't hold that bad energy yeah. like I don't know go have a bit I, of chocolate I'm, I'm kind of like you can go and take a flying <laughs> Colin's, Colin's like typing out stuff, swearing at them, going F up. And I'm like, no, Colin. <laughs> no so much right. swearing. I win, I win on that. But yeah, um, so I always think that funny. So please don't worry. Like if you leave a negative comment, like don't worry about it. Like it doesn't, it doesn't like impact it us. It happens. Like it doesn't impact us. And also as well, sometimes I think like some of the comments, like even if they're not positive, like they're really super constructive. And I think they've really helped us learn. But I just want you to know that it doesn't bother us. And also, please protect your peace. Like, so if you didn't enjoy that and you're listening, I just relax because it's not <laughs> worth it. It isn't worth it. Yeah. It isn't worth it. And if the intro's too long, skip it. Like, just skip it. Just go be like, Brr. right? <laughs> Brr. That's how you skip. You've got to make that noise as well. Um, I feel I feel so chuffed that you like that because. I know Colin doesn't like horrors and uh, we've been together like a year and a half just now. 
uh, just over a year, mm -hmm. maybe not quite a year and a half, coming up to a year and a half. And um, any little horrors that we've touched on or the ones that you've had seen that I've liked that you have seen, you're like, still like it, still like it, still like it. Don't like it. So I feel pretty impressed. Um, so yeah, if you've got to this point and you have enjoyed the content, please do subscribe. Make sure you turn on the bell so you get a wee notification um, when we put out new content so you don't miss it and you can be one of the first people to watch it. And yeah, I thank you so much. I'm Lorna, this is Colin, and uh, we are a wee bit reacts. Bye.